Okay, let's take a look at our problem. So linearization of the function. Uh, there's the function and our um, center point is pi over six and we wanna estimate the value of the function at B 0.5, all right. So let's take a look at an illustration. What's really going on here? All right, here's our function. We're gonna need the derivative, so let's write that down. Okay. Now I wanna look at a tangent line. This is uh, far off from the center. Okay, the center that we're looking at is pi over six. Okay. So we're looking at the center way out from, actually we're estimating at 0.5, right? So we're, I wanna just see what that, what that approximation would look like. There's our center point. Okay, so the approximation would be the value, okay, of the tangent line at our point, 0.5, okay, so we can read it right off the graph here. Now, you can see this is not a good estimate, right? Um, this is the actual value, so it should be somewhere here. Okay, then what I wanna show is that as we move this tangent line closer and closer to the center, the approximation improves. Okay, so the approximation can be read right off the graph where the tangent line it's the y-axis, okay. So now as the tangent line shifts down to the center, you see the approximation there improving. Okay, until here, it's very good. Okay, so what we wanna do is get an equation for this tangent line and plug in 0.5 and find the value of that line at the value 0.5. Okay, so let's look at the calculation now. All right, so we're gonna use the point slope formula. Let's just pause it here. Okay, so I moved the y sub zero over here. So this is the slope. Okay, and x zero is the center point, which is pi over six. Okay, so that would be the equation of the tangent line, and we just need to get the value of it at 0.5. Okay, so the approximation looks like this. Okay, now I'm gonna use f of x as the uh, approximation, and it's approximately this tangent line. Here's the gradient, or the slope, it's the value of the first derivative at our center point and multiplied by um, our value here minus the center point plus the value of the function at the center point. Okay, that's just from the slope point line formula. Now it's just a calculation put in all these things. Okay, you need the derivative, as I said. And this calculation should go through it on paper. Just double check my work here. Um, so all the values are now plugged in and you can get a number here. All right. The approximation is, oh, well, we're not quite there, okay. Okay, so there we go. So just think of it as the, you get the tangent line, right? And you evaluate the tangent line at your point of interest, which is 0.5, that will give you this, point here. 
Okay, I hope that was helpful.